Hello everyone, welcome back to another Adobe Photoshop CC tutorial. Guys, this one we're in CC 2019. I'm going to show you how to make a photo collage very quickly just using one tool, the frame tool. It's easy to do guys, let's get it going. And that snoring you hear is my bulldog, Kingston, in case you're wondering. Alright guys, I've gone ahead and created a new document. So if you want to follow along, file new. And I'm just going to go under web. And we're going to use 1920 by 1080. And off we go. So here we go. New document. Now, if you look over here on the left side, you're going to see this frame tool. Or you can just press K to get it. I'm going to go ahead and create a couple frames. And you'll see what I'm doing once I get a couple in here. So I'm just going to left click on it. And I'm going to build a frame here. Let's say one frame here. Uh, we're going to make a small frame there. And maybe another small frame here. What do you think? I don't even know. I'm just winging it right now, and then maybe one big frame wide, one frame at the bottom. I don't know, guys, what the collage that you guys would want it to look like. I'm going to put this in the center. There we go. That's in the center. Let's move that to the side. Let's move this so they're equal distance away. So we've got these two smaller frames. we got one envelope-looking frame and then one big one at the bottom. I'm going to left click on the top one here and then I'm going to go to my finder or if you're using a uh, PC you want to go to Explorer and I've just got some pictures here pre-selected that I'm just going to start dragging and dropping in to show you how this works. So here's a really, well let's use this one, this is a higher resolution picture. As I hover over top of the frame you're going to notice that it's getting ready to accept the picture. I drop it, boom, it's in the frame. I'm just going to increase the size a little bit and you notice that even though it's outside the boundaries, those frame boundaries, they act like a border. So it is basically framed inside. So where this is a really cool tool, I actually didn't really know much about this until recently. I'm going to get this second comedy picture. I'm going to go right into Photoshop, drag and drop it right here. And boom, we've got another picture inside. I'm going to go ahead and just resize it a little bit to make it a little, I don't know, a little better something like that right okay enter it and then for this one here I'm gonna I'm not even gonna left click on it I'm gonna go ahead and drag and drop maybe this guy on top of it let's see what that nope I didn't mean that. that that one's just way too small let's go with this one okay nice small picture but whatever um, this is a bigger document than maybe I would normally use but the bottom line is is the framing here we're, we're creating by, by using the frame tool, we can basically just drag and drop images into these preset frames and then just manipulate them and not have to worry about cutting and cropping and editing off and chopping off the sides and all that crazy monkey stuff that we have to do sometimes to get it just right. Goldilocks, right? And for the bottom, I'm going to go ahead and drop in, let's drop in a stand-up comedy uh, cast that I had. Put those guys in there. That, that file is a little bit too big. So let's see here, let's maybe, I don't know, maybe something like that. And we'll just do one set of comedians like this. I don't know, whatever. We're, you, you see where I'm going with this stuff, right guys? And I'll zip it up. Bottom line is, guys, using this frame tool, you can go ahead and drag and drop in all sorts of cool pictures and make a collage in seconds. And this is one of the fastest ways to do it. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. I have a ton more stuff coming up, and I'll be back soon.